friends welcome to gurgaon the millennium city of india in this video i want to demonstrate direct chop in a routine case no big deal just divide the nucleus into pieces by direct chop no trenching and just hold the nucleus with vacuum and chop it into fragments it saves time it saves ultrasonic energy and the cornea remains clear the next day in this case i have done only one side port the main incision is at around 10:30 o'clock the side port is at around 1:30 o'clock the anti capsule is incised with a 26 gauge bent needle a capsular tag is raised now i hold this capsular tag with the tip of forceps go anticoice and do a rexis of adequate size about 5.5 mm i to hydrodissection by a 27 gauss cannula it is attached to a 2 cc disposable syringe fluid wave is passed and i look at the fluid wave it goes to the opposite equator the nucleus is tapped and the nucleus is rotated visco is again injected and now see the direct shot go in aspirate some superficial cortical lens matter and now just in front of the main incision bury the tip into the substance of the nucleus hold the nucleus firmly at the center and chop it the routine cases where the nuclear sclerosis is grade 2 plus or grade 3 it is no big deal to chop the nucleus just you have to hold the nucleus at the center and chop it into pieces it saves a lot of time if we spend significant amount of time even without using ultrasonic energy just the fluid wave the turbulence of the fluid can cause some damage to the corneal endothelium so it is much better if we can do the surgery in a short time in a routine case so nucleus is manage the nucleus also has come out and there is very little cortex since there is only one side port i'm using a simco cannula to remove the cortex there are some cortex from 4 o'clock to 8 o'clock And now this is hydro implantation of a monofocal single piece intraocular lens. The lens goes into the capsular bag. There was some visco in the lumen of the cartis. It is irrigated out. And now 
Now we are towards the end of the surgery. We just have to close the side ports by hydrating corneal stroma and conclude the case. So it is not a big deal to divide the nucleus into pieces by direct chop. And it is not the chopper which does the job. It is the uh, delicate muscles of your hand that holds the chopper and brings the chopper from periphery to the tip of the phaco needle at a certain depth. If you just scratch the nucleus, it doesn't occur. So you have to reach a certain depth and bring it to the tip of the phaco needle and chop the nucleus. Hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills. Please learn direct job for routine cases. There is no need of spending a lot of time doing trench, doing divide and conquer, doing stop and chop. Do direct job, finish up the case in 10 minutes. Thank you very much.